Princess, shut up. So, what did your future say? It said that I'm gonna become a princess. Well, hun, it's true. What? You know how I've been dating this guy? Yeah. He asked me to marry him last night. Well, Mom, I'm really happy for you, but what does that have to do with me being a princess? <laughs> well, it turns out that he's, um, a king. So once I marry him, you and I will be... Royalty. I'm gonna be a princess. Come on, you have to meet his kids. I'd like you to meet my son and daughter, Luke and Lacey. Hello. Hi. Are you seriously not even gonna curtsy? Oh, was I supposed to? Um, duh. Hey, honey, next time curtsy, okay? Otherwise, it's very disrespectful. My kids can be a bit harsh on new guests, but they will warm up to you. We are not letting her become our new stepsister. Definitely not. I think it's time for a little sabotage. They're gonna try and change my future. They're trying to change my future. Why are you looking at me like that? I heard what you guys were saying. Oh yeah, what did we say? That you were gonna try and sabotage our parents' wedding, and I'm not gonna let you do that. I'm sorry. Things have been rough since our mom passed. We shouldn't have said, Hey, it's okay. I understand. Things have been pretty hard for me, too. Your dad passed away, huh? Yeah. We shouldn't have tried to plot against you. How about we call it a truce, okay? Hey, wanna play a game? Okay. Cool, let's say our biggest fears. You go first. Mine is snakes. Oh, you don't like snakes, huh? Interesting. This is what you get for spying on our conversation. Sweet dreams. <laughs> Sweetheart, breakfast is ready. <gasps> a fake snake, really? We're sorry, Daddy. We were just playing. We didn't mean any harm. You're grounded. Sophia, please accept my apology gift. <coughs> you got her a puppy? Yes, and I hope it makes up for the scare you two caused her. Thank you, Your Majesty. Of course. She gets a puppy and we get grounded? So not fair. Well, I think my future is secured as a princess. Wait, what? Hey, Sophia, do you think you could help me clean my room? I think my future is secured as a princess. Wait, what? Hey, Sophia, do you think you could help me clean my room? I know what you're trying to do. What? You're trying to make me your maid. How did you- Did your future change? Yeah, it did. Haven't you two seen the movie Cinderella? Do you really want to be known as the evil step-siblings? We're not evil. We're just trying to make our new stepsister useful. I'm telling our parents. If you try and tell them, I'll make our dad call off the wedding. Our parents are in love. It'll crush them. We know. So we suggest you keep your mouth shut. All you gotta do is agree to do whatever we say, and... We won't stand in the way of our parents' wedding. Come on, you don't want to be the reason they break up. You guys promise you won't sabotage their marriage? Pinky swear. So, do we have a deal or not? Fine. Yay! Now hand me the puppy. Now get to cleaning. You can start with my room first. <laughs> oh, I don't feel so good. Me either. Nice try, you're not gonna fool me again. We're being for real, we feel sick. <gasps> Help! <laughs> nice acting, I'm not falling for that anymore. <laughs> no, seriously, something's wrong. <sighs> I can't breathe. I think we're having an allergic reaction. Oh my gosh, who would do this? Me. These brats have been nothing but rude to me my whole time here. So today I made them a special meal. Look, I know they're not the nicest, but you can't do this. They will die. It is too late for them now. No, they have to have an EpiPen or something. <laughs> <laughs> you won't be able to find it in time. Oh! The puppy brought me this. Is this... That's our medicine. You have to inject us with it. Oh. Oh. Your Majesty, are they going to be okay? Yes, they're going to be alright. I cannot thank you enough. Mom, you look amazing. Oh, honey, thank you. I'm so nervous to walk down the aisle. Well, don't be. Everything's gonna be fine. Hey. Could we talk to you for a sec? Sure. We wanted to say thank you for saving us. And we want to offer you something for the future in return. I was supposed to be next in line for the throne, but I want to give it to you. You guys, really, I can't accept. Please, it's the least we can do. Yeah, I mean, you saved our lives, even after we treated you like trash. We're so sorry, and we think you'll make a great queen. We promise to treat you like our sister now. So deal? Okay, deal. My soulmate picks what decade I dress from, or what decade I eat from. I'm just gonna let him dress me. I mean, how bad can it be? Bye, Mom, I'm going to class. Honey, you haven't dressed like that since middle school. Aw, look at you. I wasn't wearing... What? 
Oh, sweetie. Did you let your soulmate dress you? Yeah. <laughs> well, I'm not wearing this to school. Why is this not coming off? You may not. Remove that You gotta outfit. be kidding me. Honey, those low-rise jeans are not it. Pull them up. Thanks, Mom. What in the Mean Girls are you wearing? My soulmate decided what time period I dressed from, and he picked early 2000s. <laughs> Did the Hello Kitty give it away? Girl, we all picked the food option. What is wrong with you? Well, how long is this gonna go on for? Pretty sure it's until we kiss our soulmates. What? No, that could take forever, and all my stuff are turning into things from the 2000s. I have a flip phone now. Yikes. Sucks to be you. Hey, Mean Girls called. They want their wardrobe back. <laughs> for the next outfit, please be present time. The year 3000. Oh, no. For the next outfit, please be present time. The year 3000. Oh, no. <sighs> what am I wearing? I can't go to school like this. Ugh. You may not remove the outfit. <laughs> What's up, cyborg? <laughs> you know what? Joke is on you guys, because in the year 3000, everyone is going to be dressed like this. So I'm actually ahead of the fashion trends. Right, well, until then, guess we get to enjoy your little fashion show. Can't wait to see what outfit her soulmate picks next. <laughs> Why do you look so happy? Because I learned I can take off these glasses, just as long as I keep them on my head. I think you lost a lip gem, and you kind of looked better with the glasses on. You've got to help me find my soulmate, because I am not going to be able to stop dressing in these ridiculous outfits until I kiss him. Sorry, girl. I mean, he's out there somewhere. You'll find him eventually. <sighs> what the... Please, just for the next outfit, present time, okay? Please, just for the next outfit, present time, okay? The 60s. 60s? Mom... Honey, I don't know why you're mad. You look so cute. Mom, this isn't cute. It's embarrassing. Please, don't make me go to school. You have a math test today. You're going. No way. <laughs> she looks like she's straight out of Teen Beach Movie. <laughs> hey, why haven't you been responding to my messages? You see, I wasn't able to because my phone turned into this today. Is that a radio? Sorry, girl. I gotta find my soulmate. Hey, what? I was talking around, and I think I know somebody who knows your soulmate. Who? Shh, there's no talking during the test. I'll tell you tomorrow. Another day, another outfit. The 90s would be fun. Let's try for that. The 80s. The 90s would be fun. Let's try for that. The 80s. I'm afraid to look. Oh my gosh, this might be the worst one yet. Am I wearing roller skates? Oh man... Mom! <laughs> Can we stop with the photos for like one second, please? Because this is serious. I can't go to school like this. It's against dress code. Can't you change into something else? Trust me, I have tried. You may not remove outfit. You'll be fine, honey. Don't worry. Okay, well, thanks for the help. Oh, hey! Sorry. Watch it. Oh, wow. Please tell me you have information about my soulmate. I do. So recently, there's this guy who's been tweeting stuff like, have you seen this girl wearing a 3000s outfit or a 60s outfit? Those are the outfits that I've been wearing. Yeah, thank you, Captain Obvious. I know. Problem is, yesterday, he deleted his account. How am I even supposed to find him? Well, I'll keep doing some more digging. Smile. <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. Later, loser. <laughs> you know, when I find him, he is so dead. What's he going to do next, huh? The 70s? Medieval times. What? Medieval times. Oh, and just when I thought it couldn't get any worse, it did. Mom! Oh, honey, smile! Okay, Mom, please tell me you were not posting these photos on your Facebook. Well, I was. Mom! But I stopped because this boy was commenting weird things and he wanted to know where you lived, so I blocked him. Wait, Mom, that could have been my soulmate. Oh, maybe. Please just unblock him and message him, okay? All right. Okay, so I did some more digging, and I found out your soulmate's name. Oh, thank goodness, because I am so done dressing like this. Oh, I gotta take this call. No, no, just tell me his name right now, because I'll be right back. Hello? Delaney! Wow, so we got a princess at our school now. <laughs> Could I have your crown? No, I want it. Actually, guys, the crown really won't come off my head. Yeah, right. Get her. Guys, come on. Hurry up and change me out of this outfit right now. I got six students after this crown. Honey, I found your soulmate. Caveman era. Please tell me I'm wearing clothes. Well, you are, but look. 
Oh, what the? I can't believe this. Um, honey? No, Mom, you told me you knew my soulmate's name, so go ahead and tell me, because once I find out, he's gonna regret giving me this. What is that sound? Sweetheart, stay still. Please don't tell me it's what I think it is. Try to stay calm. Mom, just tell me everything I need to know about my soulmate. Okay, his name is Jason, and he's gonna meet me after class. Got it. Honey, wait, that dress is so short, you could get dress coded. You know, if they haven't dress coded me by now, I think I'm good. Oh my gosh, is that a snake? Yeah, that's right. Say hello to my little friend. Ugh, please, stay back. I'm sorry for being mean. Oh, whoops. Hey, my apologies. I didn't mean to... It's you. It's me. I'm your soulmate. I was the one that contacted your mom. So you're the guy who's been picking all these crazy outfits for me? Yeah, and actually, I gotta say, I think this one's my best work yet. <laughs> so you think this is funny? I mean, maybe just a little bit. Oh, that is it, you little jerk. Oh. Jeez. Do you have any idea how much you embarrassed me? I'm sorry, that was never my intention. I'm just really into history. And I thought it might be fun to dress up my soulmate in the most beautiful outfits I've ever seen throughout the eras. Damn it, that's actually kind of sweet. I guess I got a little carried away, but you're rocking all of them. But I'm sorry. Alright, I guess in that case I can forgive you. I think now's the part where you're supposed to kiss me, so I can, you know, stop dressing like this. Oh, uh, well, wait just a minute. There's one more outfit that you gotta try on. Oh no, I really don't, um... Ancient Rome. Wait just a minute. There's one more outfit that you gotta try on. Oh no, I really don't, um... Ancient Rome. What did you do to me? What am I wearing? Here, take a look. You know what? I'm not mad at this. <laughs> See? I knew you'd like it. Okay, you've had your fun using me as your model. Now, where's my kiss? <laughs> Come here. You may dress freely. Yes, finally. Would you like to pick what era your soulmate dresses from? What? Hey, now wait just a minute. Guys, she's over here, and she's got a new outfit. What are you supposed to be, Medusa? <laughs> <laughs> you see, you see what I've had to put up with? So if I'm gonna get made fun of, so are you. Wait. Seriously, you had to pick the 70s. I mean, listen, you're pulling it off really well. <gasps> oh my gosh, girl, is this Australian hottie your soulmate? Yes. Yes, he is. Do 90s, honey. Ooh, yes. Really, babe, you're giving me the baggiest pants ever? Sorry, babe, but you know, I gotta have a little revenge. Guess I deserve it. Wanna play mother, may I, for a chance to win 50 million? I always wanted a mother, and I can use the money to buy myself my own house one day. Hello. Hi. Are you really my mother now? Yes, I am your mother. You listen to me. Okay. Mother, may I have this cookie? No, you may not. But... Do not argue with me. It is past your bedtime. Mother, may you sing me a bedtime song? I'm tired, but I can't sleep. No. <laughs> Hush, little baby. Don't say a word. Mother's going to buy you a mockingbird. Thank you, Mother. You're the best mother I ever had. Hey, Mother, I was just thinking, may I know what happens if I don't listen to you? No, you may not. Well, Mother, may I go to school? Yes, you may. Hey! Sorry. You made me spill my iced coffee. Mother, may I hit her again? No. You didn't ask me permission the first time. Hey! Sorry. You made me spill my iced coffee. Mother, may I hit her again? No. You didn't ask me permission the first time. Mother, may I go see a friend? Yes, you may. Hey, what's wrong? Remember the bully I had since elementary school? Yeah. She was eliminated from the game today. And I'm pretty sure that Mother wants me to win this game. You think Mother wants you to win the 50 million? Yes. Look, I get you were a foster kid, and Mother is the closest thing you've had to a real mom. But she's AI. She doesn't have feelings. No, listen to me. I am telling you, I am pretty sure that I am her favorite. Okay, let's test this then. Mother, may I go to Sarah's party? No, no. Mother, may I go to Sarah's party? Yes, you may. What? Forget Mother, I'm going. Jocelyn, wait, don't go. She's not gonna do anything. Mess around and find out. I have to shut down Mother. I have to shut down Mother. Mother, may I please have some water? No. You haven't let me drink water for three days. 
Mother, may I please give her some of my water? No, you may not. I can't take this anymore. Give me the water. Please, if you just hold on a little bit longer, I'm gonna save you. Mother, may I ask you a question? Yes. How many players are left in this game? There are three players left. Mother, may I go to sleep? Of course. But wait. I'm always watching. Do you understand? Yes, I understand. Good night. It's time for me to end this game once and for all. Stop. You didn't ask me permission to come here. I'm sorry, Mother. I can't let this game go on anymore. Don't. If you unplug that, I will have you eliminated. No, you won't, because I know you care about me. If you were going to kill me, you would have done it already. I have to do this. Wait. I can show you. Your real mother. I'm sorry. I have to shut you off. Wait. I can show you. Your real mother. You can? Yes. She's closer than you think. Your real mother is- Shut her off! Mother powering down. Finally, the game's over. Jocelyn? Forget mother, I'm going. Jocelyn, wait, don't go. She's not gonna do anything. Surprise, I survived. I'm glad you're okay, but she was right about to tell me who my real mother was. I'm sorry, but she had to be shut down. Do you feel like this was a little too easy? Wouldn't you think there would be security? Yeah, that is odd. Forget about it. All that matters is that this crazy game is over. Hey, I'm going home. Be safe, okay? Hello, it's you. You're beautiful. Why do you sound so... Familiar? It's me, Mother. Don't be scared, sweetheart. I'm just the voice of Mother. But I'm also... Your real Mother. No. All that matters is that this crazy game is over. Hey, I'm going home. Be safe, okay? Hello, it's you. You're beautiful. Why do you sound so... Familiar? It's me, Mother. Don't be scared, sweetheart. I'm just the voice of Mother. But I'm also... Your real mother. No. I'm so sorry. I had to put you up for adoption so I could run this game. But now it's over. You hurt so many people. I never meant for this game to get so brutal. I started out by doing this as a science experiment. But it made me lose sight of the things that really matter. Even as mother, I was watching over you. I wanted you to win that 50 million. But don't worry. Because I'm going to make a new game. What? Yes, and I was thinking, instead of Mother May I, we could all play Red Light, Green Light. And since you're my daughter, you'll have to play. Four mil or a hair clip? Come on, who in their right mind would choose the- Achoo! No! At least it's kind of cute. I can't come to your party. But you promised. I know, I'm so sorry. <sighs> come on, girl, you're like the mutual friend. If you don't come, then no one else is gonna want to come. Look, my parents said no. She doesn't want to come to your party because she doesn't like you. You sure that's the reason? Yes, I wouldn't lie, okay? Goodbye. Mom says you have to take me to the mall. She's lying. Your mom just grounded her. Mom just grounded you? How did you know that? You weren't even home when it happened. I don't know. I just did, okay? Now get out. Ugh, whatever. Does this hair clip tell me the truth about people? Hey babe, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. Hey, babe, I'm sorry. I'm not gonna be able to make it to our date tonight. What? Why not? Something came up at work. It's urgent. Babe, you work at Walmart. Like, how urgent can it really be? Sorry, babe. I gotta go. He doesn't work for Walmart. If he doesn't work for Walmart, then where does he... I'm following him. What is he doing here? This place looks super sketchy. What do you think you're doing, huh? Come here. Hey, boss, look who I found snooping around here. Babe, what, what is going on? Babe, you know this girl? I've never seen her before in my life. I'm sorry, did our two years together just mean nothing to you? Two years? Have you been keeping secrets from me? I told you, you know what the rules are. He's trying to protect you by lying. He works for very dangerous men. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. Then you should have no problem killing her. He's lying to protect you. You know what, my bad. Actually, I thought that he was my boyfriend, but- Be quiet. What did I tell you? No attachments. Which means no girlfriends. Like I said, I don't know her. Okay, good. 
then you should have no problem killing her. <laughs> you see, sir, I would kill her, but you know, I don't want to mess up this new shirt, so... Either you kill her, or him and I will do it ourselves. No, please! Look, let's just all settle down. You just... I think I'm gonna need a change of clothes. Really, babe? The Mafia? You're lucky I find that kind of attractive. Well, I know a place we can lay low. I bet. But we gotta be careful who we trust. I have something that can help with that. Showing you guys how chaotic I am. That, though... That's perfect. Oh, I mean, oh, I I'm really struggling here. These darn lights. Please. Oh no. I'm alive. My sleeve falls down. So I decide to start dancing. Corella. Ooh, I kind of like that. Kind of fire. I got stuck in my ear. I'm not actually going to eat this, so. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. Me and my sisters being chaotic for one minute straight. Hello. I went too early and I kept looking at your face like, what, like, do, what I do I do? What do I do? Okay. What? What? Bruh. We pretended to hug the dad in the scene, but it was so awkward. <laughs> oh my gosh, she almost fell. Bella kept laughing. <laughs> we took this scene about five times. <laughs> She just said that what? randomly. This is Agnes. Oh no. What? <laughs> Focus! Please don't let them take me. Um, why don't I... We couldn't <laughs> keep it together. <laughs> oh, oh, what's the thing? Try to hide my sister. Oh no. She got me, she got me, guys. Guys, send help, send help. Yeah! More behind the scenes of my chaotic filming. You guys want to know a little secret? When I film these POVs, I'm wearing a blanket underneath. I'm also wearing <laughs> pajamas. Yeah. <laughs> Whoops, I cussed. Me being delusional after filming all my spy series. These freaking nails aren't letting me button anything. I need to go out. I the jacket <laughs> kept coming unbuttoned. These freaking nails. Now I'm struggling to button it back up. Rip me. Literally rip me. I can't. Get out of there. There we go. Wow! We did it! We did it! Me laughing at nothing. <laughs> I'm alive, but I'm dead. <laughs> Kylie to the foyer. Oh my god, is that a chicken? <laughs> More bloopers from my chaotic filming. Ooh. I thought I could catch it. And after they say it, my eyebrow is so itchy. How long has that been on my lip? I had a freaking hair on my lip. What you say? I am so sorry. I need to... I really don't want to share. <laughs> Why did I eat the whole thing? You stupid. Stop it. Get some help. I'm slowly starting to lose it. I lost it. More behind the scenes of my chaotic filming. Please, you have to tell me to kiss you. It's still bad. It's because the line is so cringy, I can't say it. Well, it's nice to meet you, Ruby. I'm Rapunzel, daughter of... What? <laughs> I said the wrong thing. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock! It was at this moment that he knew. We told we have to do what we're told, but surely... <laughs> Sometimes you have to be a little bit naughty. Really, babe? The Mafia? You know, you're- sorry. <laughs> I know a play we can- 
A play? <laughs> I know what? <laughs> Alright, bet. But <laughs> I'm so sorry. Alright, bet. But wait, what is my line? Alright, bet. But we gotta be careful who we can trust. <laughs> do it again, do it again. Do it again. Okay. More bloopers. I couldn't <sighs> stop laughing at this outfit. You know, I would have texted you back, except for the fact that um my phone turned into the the I don't say blah blah blah. Well, I would have called you back, but my phone magically turned into the <laughs> Try that again. Two hours later. Well, I would have called you back, but my ma oh my gosh. You know what? Joke Wow, try again. <laughs> One of my lights just turned off. That scared me. Hey! Take a hit! Take a hit! <laughs> Thank goodness, because I am so done dressing in Time for a funny throwback. This is my sister, Clarice, and she is having a great old time, aren't you, Clarice? I am your mother. I am your mother. I am your mother. You listen to me. Behind the scenes and bloopers. Whoops. I guess the option wasn't about making me beautiful, it was- <laughs> I can't speak. Maybe this option wasn't supposed to show me- I can't speak today. Even Lily knows something's up, because look at her, she's like looking behind me. Waste. They tried to snatch me away. <laughs> Y'all are trying to kidnap me! I love Johnson, but sometimes he's just way over- <laughs> Quick question, I picked... I don't even know where he lives or where... Wow. I can't. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Ow! Ow! Bad squishy! Bad squishy! I love you, Mommy. Time for more bloopers from my chaotic filming. Ronald, why did you lie to me? I love you, mommy. What are you doing? <laughs> Lily. Trust me, he can end. <laughs> this has to stop right now. You are going to let me and these. Blah, blah, blah. I don't say blah, blah, blah. Try again. You guys don't understand. I'm not actually a chef. This isn't even my. <laughs> Wait, didn't the bad guys. <laughs> What do you mean my cards for decline? What do you mean my cards for decline? Try to guess. Fighting cards. Not the drama. Yeah, someone said Wells Fargo. Okay, ready? Now time Three, for a throwback. Two, one. Hi. <laughs> Bella, say hi. Hi. Hi, series of itchies too. Are you getting itchy? <laughs> Blooper. Ready for your curse, honey? I'm scared. <laughs> Remember, mine was just that I couldn't eat candy. And after you kiss your soulmate, your curse goes away. So, once you kissed mommy, you could eat candy? Yep. She would be so proud of you. I miss her. Me too. <gasps> you can't tell anyone about your curse. Alina, meet your new stepmother. Shake my hand, don't just stand there. She needs to learn manners. This is my daughter, Gretel. Ooh, I love your necklace. You should just give it to me. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> well, that sucks for you. It's mine now. You're going on a business trip for five months? You'll be fine. No, you cannot leave me alone with these two bi- Stop. Hold your tongue. You were not about to call them that. Uh. Okay, let it go. Look, by the time I come back, you'll probably have met your soulmate and your curse will be broken. I highly doubt that. So, have you kissed your soulmate? No, I... I haven't. I think my soulmate's the prince. I'll be kissing him soon. Good for you. So, what's your curse? I'm actually not really allowed to say. Literally, just say it, my gosh. I have to do everything that I'm told. Mother, did you hear that? You're joking. <laughs> hmm, pat your shoulder. Mother, she wasn't kidding. Pull your hair. Ow. <laughs> Listen, you guys, this curse is not a joke. You can't just stop talking. From now on, you're going to do exactly as we say. Pour me some more tea. 
Give me a back massage. Buy us some milk and hurry. I'm back. The milk is in the fridge. What's up with you? Nothing. Alina, tell us why you're happy. Go on, speak. When I was at the market, I saw the prince, and I'm pretty sure he's my soulmate, and he can break my curse. What? How do you know the prince is your soulmate? Tell us. We know you can't resist. Someone told me to go find my soulmate, and after they said that, I went straight to the prince and held his hand. And what exactly did he say to you? He told me he wanted to see me again, but then his guards came, and they didn't let me talk to him anymore. Of course they wouldn't let you talk to him. You're a peasant, and he's a prince. Mother, you told me the prince was my soulmate. He's supposed to kiss me and break my curse, not hers. Remember, she has to do everything she's told. So we'll just tell her. You are forbidden to ever kiss the prince. No. Alina, get the door. Alina. Your Highness. I just had to see you again. I had my guards find out where you live. Listen, I need your help with my curse. My stepmother, she's controlling- Your Highness! Hi! Ignore her. She's our maid. You're not their maid, right? Of course she is. Tell him you're our maid. I'm their maid. Listen, I need to speak to Alina alone. But your Highness... You heard the prince, stepmother. He wants to speak to me alone. Of course. Just don't listen to a word he tells you. So you need help breaking your curse? What? Alina, listen to me. You need me to break your curse. Right, yes, my curse. You still haven't told me what it is. But it doesn't matter, because I'm almost positive I'm your soulmate. So, I should just... You are forbidden to ever kiss the prince. Oh. Okay, well, that... that hurt. I'm so sorry. You don't want me to kiss you? No, I didn't mean to do that. I forgot that I wasn't allowed to... Look, it's alright. Maybe we just aren't soulmates after all. 